morning gentlemen morning. Morning. my name is Azizu and uh, today I'm going to tell you about teamwork and leadership okay which is very important wherever you go okay uh, the, because uh, teamwork provide the synergy okay example if you are in your group discussion and teamwork, a lot of ideas can come from each of you. For example, what do we do for the past three days? We always do the teamwork. So individual of the group can provide more ideas. For example, ideas from Datuk Jale and ideas from Azizi we match it together, we blend it, and then that is, we come up with a good decision for if we do group as a teamwork, okay? And then one more thing, people act and behave is quite different when they are in part of group. And because one more thing, uh, teamwork discussion will be a good decision making. See? Number of people interact, they are sharing OM or experience. And then you can see group need to achieve group and M need to have effective teamwork with good leadership. Behalf of group can be created based on their leader and teammate. In order to say that if we do a teamwork is good is good for us because the decision will come up with a good decision. Okay? This is a, the the I mentioned to you earlier. See? Teamwork is ability to cooperate with others achieve group objective and then an individual group work efficiently and productivity with others. Effective teamwork can provide synergy as I mentioned to you earlier. So synergy may generate the best solution or ability to understand the situation through team decision. Leadership traits can affect teamwork negatively or positively. Or and good leadership take effect positively in bad in team opposite to bad leadership take effect in negative so guys i want to ask you some question <coughs> what do you think about teamwork mr vijay the teamwork is always helpful uh, it's better than working as an individual uh, they contribute to more uh, ideas Coming, especially when you are having to solve a problem or decision making. Mm -hmm. So, teamwork, uh, of course, is come up with a better decision in the end, rather than individual. Thank you, Mr. Vijay, for your opinion. What about you, Dato Jale? Teamwork. What can you buy somebody else? <laughs> <laughs> because I want your opinion because you. I mean the most experienced guy because oh, uh, we cannot <laughs> forget you because you are the most senior guy here maybe your opinion is very good for us like me young generation okay. actually I'm not quite young now <laughs> the word itself uh, tells you the meaning of it like team and working and work you work together as a team okay you know when you work together as a team, you share knowledge, you share opinion, you uh, discuss about things in a broader perspective. So, and then you come up with a good decision based on the teamwork uh, discussion. Thank you so much, Tato, for the opinion. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And then, we move to the next is leadership. Leadership. Do 
Do you guys know the Danish definition of leadership? No. What about you, Mr. Albert? Can you tell the class the definition of leadership? My short and simple is leaders eat last. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Albert. Okay, the 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 actual meaning is the, the art of motivating a, of a group people to act toward achieving in a common goal, combination of personality and leadership skill. Okay? As you as I mentioned to you earlier, we have three types of leadership. Oh, we have three types of leadership type. The first one is autocratic, the second one is democratic, the, the third one is uh, there's a, how to spell or how to pronounce it. Yeah. 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 Okay? Okay. The first one I will inform you, autocratic is a leader interact with interaction and behavior are focused on providing effective effectiveness and relationship factor are efficient, efficiently ignored. Okay? Like Hitler, I think. Okay? And then the second one is democratic. Democratic is uh, leader behavior where followers are given responsibility to do decision making. Like our country, we are practice the demo democratic. And then the last one is the religious fair. Leadership allows the group to do whatever they wish. Okay? See, that is autocratic leader. For example, the military will often use an autocratic leadership style because soldier needs to rely on his state and constantly in time of danger. No more class oriented leader interact in post time and stand manner, focus on productivity effectiveness. That is autocratic leader. And this is democratic leader, known as participated participate staff, encourage staff to be part on decision making, go to relationship oriented, and many companies and leaders who have applied democratic. And then the last one is this fair leader, known as delegative leadership, leaders are hand off and allow group members to, to make their decision and then provide the vision and trust in the people's capabilities to complete tasks and achieve objectives and then leaders still take responsibility for the group decision and action to the group. And then the conclusion of the what we discussed today is effective leadership based on a style, situation, and environment of the work. There are three times when uh, the different leadership style is necessary for specific situation. Good leadership can improve efficient and also motivate them, motivate the team to achieve the goal and it can help create a clear open channel communication to improve productivity, help keep moral high and provide individuals with a sense of identity as purpose. The, that is the conclusion for today. And then uh, if you guys want to ask me about team leader, or um, teamwork, you may ask me, but I will give you the answer from my level best. Now, if you want to ask me, you can ask me. Okay? I will give you what I have based on my true experience. Any question, you guys? Have you done uh, any teamwork uh, assessment 
for your new condo to play the dispatch? Yes, we do because every every year we do the assessment and then we discuss among us what is going to wrong with the department, what is good, what is bad, how to improve. So each of them will come up with the ideas because we have a lot of people down there, we have a lot of ideas. So, Thank you so much for listening to my facilitation because I'm not very really that good, but I'm trying to be good. But thank you for today. Thank you. Thank you.